What's up guys? I thought I would do uh, my mental health update. I'm trying to make this a monthly thing. One mental health update video every single month, uh, both for myself, because talking about things that um, truly are um, hard to talk about is important for me. But it's also important for you guys to hear it from someone like me. So hopefully it will inspire you or at least nudge you in the right direction to talk to someone if you are also having um mental health issues i guess the best way to say it is um for myself i feel like overall i've improved a little bit since the last video um what i've noticed is overall i improved but there are certain days and uh, today is actually one of them um although i'm you know i'm trying to get through it where I, like something small could really pull you down and really um really bring you down and sometimes you don't even know what that is like i'm i'm i sat there today and i've been really depressed today and i've been trying to think like what is it that triggered me to be so depressed like why am i so depressed today is it the food i've ate is it the lack of being outside is it uh, work and stress related is it um health related um and i'm still yet to pinpoint it, but i've noticed that some days i just fall real hard and um it's hard to pick yourself up from that but I think overall, I'm doing a little bit better. Uh, what I've noticed for myself is now that summer is approaching, I'm trying to get outside more. This is a big push for that. Um, obviously, me and my wife converting that school bus is a push to simplify my life and get outside a little bit more. And um, it's bringing me a little bit of happiness. What I found is um, the, the young Luke, before he went in the Royal Marines, was obsessed with bushcraft, survival, the wilderness, nature. And when I went into the Royal Marines and I was forced to be in these crappy scenarios and I ended up hating my life pretty much. Um, I think when I left the military, I had this huge kind of pushback to being outdoors a lot. I stayed inside, I played a lot of video games, which there's nothing wrong with. There's nothing wrong with staying inside and playing video games every now and again, especially during the winter. However, there needs to be a bit of a yin and yang and, and a seasonal movement to your body where you should get outside more. And what I found is I'm starting to bring them little habits back in my life of enjoying the wilderness and bushcraft and enjoying being outside more. And I think it is helping my mental health a little bit. Um, another big thing as well is taking Monday off. Um, for some of you who don't know, I don't upload a video any do anymore on Monday. And even though I tell you guys it's Monday off, it's actually technically Sunday because I record the day before. So it's technically Sunday off. Um, and that's helping a lot. That's helping and an, way more than you guys realize just taking one day off. Um, I think it's important sometimes to just sit down and kind of reflect on the week and um have time to just sit around um i'm so busy in my life that it's really hard to find that time to just you know not switch on and and, and I'm, I'm saying like so with my job as a youtuber i have an ungodly amount of things like i'm like i'm spinning a bunch of plates right i've got emails to send sponsorships to sort out videos to make and um when i relax at the end of the night sometimes i feel a little guilty and i feel like that's part of my anxiety and depression where i feel guilty that i'm not doing some of the stuff i should be doing or should be doing for work um but on my day off i make sure i just don't think about it that's my day i don't care what anybody emails me or texts me or calls me or messages me that's my day off disconnecting from work and that's really important it's something that i've not done before on the past couple of mondays i've had off have been an absolute gem they really have um so i think taking time to just sit and do nothing is important um i've also found with um being outside in nature more is that i'm moving my body more and i don't know whether getting a little bit fitter physically is helping my mental um stability which i think it is to a certain extent but um we all know the exercising definitely helps with um you know mental health going out for a run releasing them endorphins is is really important so that's definitely helping also because of me and my wife doing this whole school bus thing we're pretty much selling everything so the house is pretty empty right now and although that's kind of daunting having a lot of space with nothing in it it's also really nice um to not have that many things like it looks like i have a lot of things because of the background but if you look over here 
where I used to have that sulfur and the nice TV. It's pretty much empty. Um, there's no sulfur, no TV, no stand, no nothing. Um, no Peloton bike, got rid of all that. Um, and it's kind of refreshing because it's like that around the whole house to not have to worry about a lot of stuff. We went through our whole kitchen last night and ditched a lot of stuff, basically. Or, or we put it into a cupboard that we're going to send to the charity to Goodwill. And um, it's nice to just have a few objects. And I know people go, it's it's such a privilege to live a simple life. It's such a privilege to be minimal. Um, but it is helping my mental health a little bit. Um, so, you know, I'm doing these videos once a month. I think it's important to talk about my mental health. But I also want to stem the question to you guys. In the last video, I had a crazy amount of amazing comments um, of people expressing their feelings, talking about the times that they may have been bullied, like I was bullied in the Royal Marines, um, about times that, you know, they've been down in the gutter or the fact that they might be in the gutter right now and feeling like crap. And I want to challenge you guys to talk about your mental health in the comments down below. I think it's really important um, to express your feelings in this really cool tight-knit community that we've got on YouTube here, uh, the original human channel. I think it's important to do that. So please go ahead and do that. Um, let me know in the comments down below how you're feeling, how you're doing. I'll certainly read through as many as I can, okay, guys? Um, another big thing as well, I've got a new app on my phone um, called BetterHelp. It's been helping me tremendously, uh, which is ironic because they reached out to sponsor me, which it hasn't happened yet. I haven't made a video yet, but I will be collaborating with better help um and basically having them sponsor these monthly mental health updates which i think again i think this is important i've not seen many people do this on youtube and um it's bad because depression is on the rise suicide is on the rise and if i can use this platform with um, not far off 400,000 subscribers to try and advocate for mental health um, especially people in the military who really struggle with it, then I will do so, okay? So again, I'm challenging you all down below in the comments to please let me know how you feel, how are you doing this week, what have you been up to, um, what are you doing to try and help your mental health, have you got any tips for anyone else like myself or other people in the comments? Um, also read through other people's comments and speak to them, let them know that you know maybe you're feeling the same way. Uh, because I'll certainly be doing that as well, guys. Um, but overall, I think I've been a little bit better. This bus project is definitely taking my mind off a lot of things. Um, again, I've said this in previous videos. I hope it's not just a band-aid. I hope that traveling and living a bit more minimally and um, challenging myself with something completely different with living in a school bus and traveling the country with my wife and my kids... I genuinely think this is going to help my mental health. I really do. And um, that's why we're doing it. Me and my wife. My wife is also struggling. And I think it's going to help us both tremendously. Um, but anyway, I'm waffling on now. Let me know in the comments. How do you feel? Um, that's the big task for you, you guys today. And what do you think? Mental health videos once a month. I'm no therapist, but I can certainly tell you how I feel. And I think that's a good step in the right direction, guys. So um, I hope you're having a great day. I love you all. Goodbye.